guys, it's Sophie. And as you can see, I'm still in my room because I have not left for California yet. I'm leaving on Sunday, so because I'm still here, I can still make a video for you guys. So today, I'm going to be doing the summer tag because it's summer and I have not done a tag in a really, really long time. So I thought, why not do a summer tag? I just found these questions online and I just wanted to answer them for you guys. So that is what I'm going to be doing. So I have the questions on my phone right here and I'm just going to be answering them. So without further ado, let's get into the video. My dream summer vacation is probably LA California because I am obsessed with California. You guys already know that. I love it so, so much. So I'd probably go there or I'd probably go to Bora Bora. I have talked about it before on my channel. I've just seen so many pictures of it on Tumblr and it literally looks so beautiful. So if you're from there or you live around there, then you are so, so lucky. It's so beautiful and I've always wanted to visit. So yeah, either one of those places, but probably like California, cause if I could live there right now, I totally would. My favorite summer drink is probably a pina colada. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of that, but it's basically like a pineapple coconut type smoothie thing. Normally when I go to hotels, it's alcoholic, like there's alcohol in it. So I just ask for it with no alcohol and it tastes so, so good. Like drinking pina coladas just reminds me of summer because I never drink pina coladas like any other time. I only drink it when I'm on vacations or things like that. So definitely a pina colada. Definitely ice cream because I love s'mores, um, but ice cream is more like a summer type food. S'mores are more like a winter type food and I love s'mores so much and if you guys don't know already, they started selling s'mores at Starbucks which is really amazing and I've gotten s'mores there before but like ice cream is just like summer and it's cold and when it gets really hot during the summer I would not want to get s'mores so probably ice cream. Definitely the beach for this one because I am obsessed with the beach so so much like I love swimming and pools and things like that but being in the ocean and being surrounded by the ocean and things like that like just the beach is really calming and relaxing to me and I'm one of those people that will just like go into the beach and actually swim like I'm not one of those people that just sits and tans on the sand like I love the ocean more than anything. probably depends because I don't live near any pools because I live in New York City so a realistic day for me would probably be me sitting in my bed on Netflix because I just don't live near any pools but if I could and I did have the option to just wake up in the morning and be like oh let me just go swim in the pool then I probably would my most fun summer memory would probably be when I was younger, um, me, my old babysitter, and my sister would always go to the park and go to amusement parks and like have picnics and stuff like that and like mini photo shoots which is like really really fun and also another memory that I had that was also really fun was going to LA with my cousin and my family and her brother and things like that we just went to California which you guys already know that I love and we just had a two-week vacation there and it was so so much fun I loved it so much so that would actually probably be my most fun summer memory LA like that was the first time I ever went to Los Angeles. We got to see the Hollywood stars and go on celebrity tours and things like that. It was so awesome. So my favorite summer nail polish is the one that I'm actually wearing right now. I don't know if you guys can see it's like this purple color and this is what it is. It's just this from Claire's, um, this purple nail polish and funny thing about this actually this is the same exact nail polish that I gave away at my last giveaway. It was so cute and I was in Claire's with my cousin and I just had to get it. So the girl that won my last giveaway is twinning with me. So Amiriel, if you're watching this, we are twinning with our nail polishes. I loved it so much so I had to get it. 
definitely sunglasses because to be honest I don't really like wearing hats in the summer they just bother me and they make me feel hotter so probably sunglasses I love sunglasses I have like a bunch right there so um, I just love wearing sunglasses in the summer there are some hats that I will wear but I don't I don't really like them in the summer so yeah sunglasses favorite summer scent is this it's actually right here um, it's this Bath and Body Works body spray um, it's called Japanese cherry blossom and it smells so so good and I bought it at summer camp and so many people there actually had it so it's a really good summer scent for me I have lots of different scents that I like and I don't really think of like is this summer is this winter I just buy scents that I love so I just happen to buy this during the summer so I've been wearing it a lot so definitely that My favorite barbecue food is probably like hot dogs, burgers, like all the regular barbecue foods like doesn't really matter to me. I could eat anything really like chicken tenders and french fries like anything that you have at a barbecue because I love barbecues so much. I go not really during the summer but normally during the school year like on different breaks and stuff like that like on Memorial Day weekends so I love barbecues. I would probably choose a one piece or a bikini. I don't really like tankinis, so if I had to choose like between a tankini or a bikini, it would go with the bikini. But the thing about that is whenever I go to the pool or the beach, um, since I'm not really that person that likes sitting back and tanning and just like relaxing, I love going in and actually like swimming, like hardcore swimming. So if I were to wear a bikini and go into the water and start swimming, then it would just fly right off of me. So if I know that I'm going to be swimming, like actual swimming, then I'd wear a one piece so then no bikinis would be flying off of me. But if I'm not really swimming and I just want to relax and spend time with my friends, um, then I'd probably wear a bikini because they are really cute, so yeah. My favorite summer series is definitely H2O. If you guys have never heard of that show, it's the show about the mermaids that used to be on Nick. It's on Netflix now and I've been watching it like religiously. Whenever there's a new summer, I always just restart the show and it's just a show that I will never get tired of watching. So H2O, if you've never watched it yet, definitely watch it and then we can just like watch it together. I'm so obsessed with it. My summer book recommendations would probably be Eleanor and Park or The Fault in Our Stars and lots of people have already read them but I just feel like those are books that people should read again and again because they're just so amazing. I've read The Fault in Our Stars once and I'm currently in the middle of reading it a second time. I also know that there's a movie that came out for Paper Towns and I've never read it yet and I really want to start reading it this summer so I'm probably going to read that too. the last question favorite thing about summer my favorite thing about summer would probably be the fact that everything that has to go on with school anything that's school related is just not there and that's not saying that I hate school or anything like that but basically it's just because school is like a really big part of everybody's lives that go to school throughout the school year they don't really have lots of time to do things that they want to do like for me I don't really have lots of time to myself or lots of time to do things that I love like YouTube when I am so focused on school and things like that so I feel like summer is just a break to get away from all of that and do what you love to do and hang out with friends and go out to places so if you are spending your summer break not really doing anything then I would recommend getting outside and doing things and enjoying your summer while it lasts because I know that you guys don't want to hear this but school is going to come back so yeah and also if you don't really know what to do during the summer if you want me to make a video on like what to do when you're bored throughout the summer then let me know in the comments down below and yeah that is basically it that is my favorite thing about summer having time to myself and doing things that I love so that was my video if you guys enjoyed it then make sure to give it a thumbs up I really hope that you guys loved it and make sure to comment down below and answer to one of the questions that I answered so like your favorite thing about summer 
book recommendations, your favorite series, your favorite scent, things like that. Just comment them all down below because I love reading you guys' comments. It's like one of my favorite things ever. And because I am leaving on Sunday to go to California, I will not be posting as I said before. Now it is official. I will not be posting. Sunday is the day that I'm gone. So this Saturday is my last day until I leave. Also, if you want to see more of me while I'm not here and I'm not on YouTube, then make sure to follow my Instagram and my Twitter, which will be right here, like sliding out right here and will be in the down bar below. And I will be keeping you guys updated on that all the time. And also, if you're new to my channel, then hi, I'm Sophie. Nice to meet you. If you're not subscribed already, then you should definitely subscribe. Click that subscribe button down below because you you can see more of me and yeah that is basically it for my video I love you all so 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 much and I will see you when I get back from California I love you and bye selling s'mores at <laughs> I hate you sorry I didn't know that that was gonna happen I'm sorry explode yes ew <laughs> you're making me feel like a bad person okay I'm sorry, I'm sorry. definitely ice cream because <laughs> what I'm sorry what is so funny to you I don't know. I don't like you're so mean. You never separate me. I'm sorry. <laughs> if you knew how I felt, okay. why would you say that? Alright, Pula Beach. I'm an uneducated mess. <laughs> <laughs> Long paralyzed. Are you sure I'm in focus? Yes. <laughs> Now, please let me film. Okay. Please. <laughs> what do you want me to do? Sophie, look at me when you're talking to me. <laughs> I'm trying to film, okay? Please. <laughs> let there be light let action. There, let there be. Okay, no, put that one down. Put that one down. Okay, good.